So today we're going to be fixing some leaking gutters. So two culprits, this stop end here, and also at the very top, you see up here, we've got this union joint here. So we've got a half round stop end, which is here, and also got the union bracket here. Now you can try and use sealants on the originals, uh, but it never really lasts longer than a few months, so it's worth just buying the extra stop ends in the union jacket and just replacing them only about two pounds each so stop end looks like this just a simple clip you clip that off and it's got a rubber inside just make sure that the rubber's in position before we clip that on and then it just sit, essentially clips back on as you can see there once it's in position it'll hold it we've got the union bracket again clips off there's a rubber inside and we just make sure that, that rubber traces all the way along here. The leaking stop end in a minute, but our sophisticated device down here opens out. But you can see even with that there, the sort of problems you're gonna get around the brick, so never leave your gutters leaking. So try and clip this off. I'm trying to hold the camera at the same time, so I won't do this at the top. Clip that off and the water should come flying out of there now. The old one, see the rubber's all clogged. You can see how the falls go in the wrong direction on this thing, so we need redoing at some point. So, I need to make sure this is as clean as possible so that the rubber's got a tight fit on it, both sides. Just try and clip this in, I can't get a good angle on it from the video. Must be up here. Try and clip this on. So there, that's that bit in position. Make sure that the rubber's in. I'll try and bring you around for the end bit where we're putting it on the end. Make sure that the rubber's in. There we go. Rubber's in position. It's a simple case of clipping that over now. I'll try and show you how I'm going to do this now. So you can see it's in position, I'm just holding it there. I'm going to do so that clips in. I'm just going to try and clip this over. I can't do it with one hand, so I'll try and get a different angle while to do it. Bro. Let's have a look at that. So that's pretty much it. Should be fully sealed. So we can give it a quick test of watering can, see how it works. Pull that in. Just check for leaks. So, just have a quick look around. Seems to be doing job. So next up is the union bracket. Yeah, so I was too, I was too afraid to film up here um, whilst doing this. Just be careful. And if you are high up, make sure you've got a trusty helper like I have. That's fixed now. Yeah, the wind was too much to film up there, so we'll show you a quick review of what we did. We actually did, we just took the front clips off. This is with the old one, actually. Let's just pull these front clips off. One. And two and then we made sure the, the rubbers were aligned and all we did was place the old section on then we clipped that over so we made sure that clipped over we then put the screw in so the screw has to go in on the angle and you can see that there's a hole for a screw we got the next section of gutter place that in and then we just clipped that second one on like that make sure in the rubbers are aligned completely and that's pretty much it